nine oh Iowa 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 Idaho what Idaho what I've never even heard of it. what is the, what is I D A H O Idaho Idaho that's Idaho I da- Idaho baby <laughs> I know. I didn't really like. I didn't really care for his to be like that. You don't bro. have to care. You just have to know. These are just. I know. Gen- this is general knowledge, actually. I know it is general it's knowledge. Just what up, Chaplin Chitters? It's your boy, your supportive friend, the one, your coach, LJ. Yes, and I'm with my co-host, the one and only, my lovely wife, my awesomeness, my supportive friend, my better half, Lady Caesar. <laughs> She is in the building. Yes, you know we about that vibe. <laughs> Each and every week. You know what I'm saying? You know, you got us with like the jump. Right now with Welcome to Sunday Fun Day. Where we're all about learning, being, being informative, informative, and having fun. So, yes, what popping on today, sweetheart, on this Sunday Fun Day? So, today, I'm here to teach you about your country. Okay. Teach me about my country. Because you know nothing about his country. You've seen in the previous episode. <laughs> nothing. He claims to be American, but mm-mm, he should be expelled. <laughs> okay. So, I, I, I did a little research and I came across 10 incredible things that you you did not know about Okay, that I did not know. America. That we did not know. Okay. Well, you, I don't have to know them. Yes, you American. did research. Yes. <laughs> No, but I'm not American. Okay. I don't have to know them. <laughs> but I, I'm sure that these, you don't know. I probably don't. <laughs> I right. probably don't. So yeah. I'm not, not only teaching him, but he's sharing with Yes, the yes, function. everyone else. Yeah, so no. Okay, come on. Okay, you will probably half know this, but I don't think you, ha- you fully know it. Okay. That U.S. has a lot of climate, different climate. Yes. At one time. Okay. At one time. At one time. So it could be... Um, Winter, spring, fall. Yeah. At the same, so at the same time. time. Okay. In different parts of the country. Yes. Okay. And um, because the U.S. is so big. So yes. one of the things that you... Okay, so this is... Um, um, it's the only country in the world that has all the Earth's five climate zones. Okay. That's one thing. You didn't know that. All the Earth's climate zones. All the climate zones that are felt in the Earth. Yes. America is the only country that has all of them. Okay. Yeah, I didn't know that. And they are, of course... Summer, spring. Those are the seasons. Okay, season. But climate zones. Okay, please tell us. So these are dry. They Areas where it's completely dry because yes, we have the desert. the deserts. We yes. have you know states that are just deserts. We have tropical, tropical, yes. You know with the um, Hawaii and the islands. The islands, you know, yes. That are part of the United States. Mm-hmm. Temperament, I think. I think New Jersey part of, <laughs> part of temperament. Whether that, that yeah. has a temper, yeah. basically. <laughs> You don't know what you're going to get. You any, never any. know what you're going to get. You wake up summer, by the time you go to bed, it's winter. Okay. Yes. California uh, like that continental, too. Continental mm-hmm. uh, and polar climates. And I think polar Real would cold. be Alaska. Would Alaska, be yes. Alaska, it's yes. Cold. cold. Yes. You know, so America has all of these climate mm. zones and it's the only country in the world. Yeah, you know what too? I I say the the last one with is really cold mm-hmm. because not just Alaska, you also have Boston, mm-hmm. uh, that get really cold in the winter time. You Chicago. have Chicago. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's why they call it the windy city. <laughs> they don't call it the windy city. But for at nothing. least they experience some other seasons. But what I'm saying is, not just the cold. You know, this country as a country. Has all these climates. All the, all the climates, And yeah. sometimes you are able to experience all of them and in one, one day. day. Yeah, I know New Jersey is like that. You can, spend all, you can spend all of it in one day. But I mean, in different states. Sometimes not specifically one state, in different states. It would be caught in, um, in Jersey and it would be super cold in Chicago. That's true, example. too. Yes, yes, and yes. It's so frosty. In okay, I got you. In, got you. Yeah. Yes, that is so true. Yes, yes. Okay. But two, mm-hmm. one thing I know you did not know. Okay. Is that. 
You do not need a driver's license uh-huh. to drive a NASCAR car. What NASCAR? Yep, NASCAR car. You know those speeding cars? Yes, that, yes. That your um, what's his name? Uh, what's his this black guy? The one number one in the world. I don't know. Um, but it is a black he's, NASCAR. He's, he's British. Um, what's his name? Not Baba. Baba Wallace. Okay, Baba Wallace. I don't yeah, think Baba, Baba is Wallace. black. He's a mixed race, but anyways, if they want to call him black, it's fine. Yeah, he's black. And also, <laughs> that's Hamilton. what I knew. I forgot mm-hmm. his first name. You don't know Hamilton? No. Number one driver in the world. Yeah. Anyways, so that's that. Okay, so you didn't know that. You did not. I was very surprised when I came across that you don't need a driver's license. That you don't need a driver's license, but these people they drive for a living. Yeah. But yeah. you do not need a driver's license. Okay. To even compete, you can come out gold without a driver's without license. Without a driver's license. Uh, okay, I guess because, you know, you're inside, the, uh, you're not driving on the, on the road. But yeah, you're I see not, driving you're driving in there. against other cars. So yeah, I, I guess know, you but... Need to know yeah, but you, and also, even if you do have a driver's license, if it's suspended for whatever reason or you've been revoked... It's fine. It doesn't matter. Yeah, because I guess you're on the racetrack, so that's probably why you're on the racetrack. Number three. Abraham Lincoln. Okay. President Ab- Abraham Lincoln mm-hmm. was the tallest president ever be. The tallest president. Okay, I didn't know that. Yep. Standing at 193 centimeters. Okay. Uh, what's feet in tall? I guess that's six true. feet. Six feet three. Three inches. Six feet four. Six four. Six feet four. Six four. Six four. Six four. So he was six feet six feet three. Six four. Six four. Says four. Oh, says four. Pretty yeah. tall president. In the U.S. history, though. Okay. I don't know about other countries, but in the U.S. US history, pretty tall. Yeah. The thing about Abraham Lincoln is that he was also in the Wrestling Hall of Fame. Okay. Yes. I okay. Didn't know that. I didn't know that neither. Yeah, he was that good in wrestling. Okay. He actually won 299 games mm. over 300. Okay. And he only lost one match. One match. In his life. Okay. Wow. So he was a. Uh, Wrestler. Good wrestler. Mm. Right. He could have just made that a career. I guess yeah. he wanted to be a politician at the end. So, number four. Did you know that New York was not initially called New York City? Or New York? Mm, I believe so, yes. I did know. I forgot the name. I didn't know. New York wasn't always New York. So when he says he forgot the name or he did know, it means he wasn't <laughs> Okay, so let me just help him out. Yes, please, help me out. It was called New Amsterdam. New Amsterdam. Okay. That New was Amsterdam. what it's called. But the new has always been there. It but was, it was in New York. It was in New York. So okay, one New, of the New things... New Amsterdam. Um, it wasn't always New York. Before the city got its now iconic name, it was actually called New Amsterdam. It was Amsterdam... It, I mean, it was called New Amsterdam because of the Dutch settlers mm. that came in. You know, Amsterdam is in Dutch. Yes, yes. Uh, that came in in the city, and they changed it to Amsterdam. New Amsterdam. The okay. name was only changed to New York when the English captured it in the 17th century. Okay, when the English captured it. So you guys have been captured a couple of times as well. Yeah. The Dutch came... So Europe was just a land of capturers, I guess. Yeah. They were going around capturing everyone. Yeah, they was capturing everyone. So when the English that, came that's in... That's where the slave um, trade went to as I well. I think that's where it started. Yeah, yeah, it was in New York, New Jersey. So they, they, they came into the docks of New yeah. York, New Jersey. A lot of them. And yeah, I'm it, sure it's the English it, that were bringing them in. Of course it the was. Dutch. I mean, yes, the, yeah. let me just say the Europeans, because yes. it seems like... Europe was just going around, just capturing, capturing. Yes, yes it was. Anyway. Well, you know, I think Christopher Columbus was your, your from. He was your, European, yes, European. European, yes, of course, definitely. So that's why I'm like, why would they commemorate somebody who's not even American? I know. Anyway. I agree. He's not American. But the question is, then, who is American? <laughs> Only the Native Americans. <laughs> yeah. So uh, the new name, which is New York, paid tribute to um, the Duke of York. Okay. Who is still English? Mm-hmm. So they kicked out the Dutch mm-hmm. person and they put him there, their own name, own person. Because only dukes are in England. Okay, only dukes in England. So people, a person is said to be a duke because they they are seen as one of the of high ranking in terms of you know just like we have the duke 
of Sussex. Sussex, yes, because he's like you know close to a, he's a prince actually, but he is of high sta- status. Okay. So not only princes and uh, um, prince get that status, but somebody who's of high high high, rank. high ranking. Yeah, but this was the Duke of York, so it was actually called New the York. York because of that. It's funny because they've never changed it. Mm. So it still remains New York because of that. And still, they say you can still see plagues of where New ha- Amsterdam's wall was, which was built in 1653 on Wall Street itself. So if you go to Wall Street, you can see uh, the wall that represented Amsterdam. Okay. Yep. Number five. U.S. was declared free from foreign rule. Foreign rule, okay. On July what? July. Uh, when they got their independence. Right? Yeah, July 4th. Wrong, was wrong, <laughs> wrong, wrong, wrong. Okay. 1776. Wrong. Nope. And that's why I knew you did not know this answer, and I think most Americans don't know it. 17, July 4th, July 3rd. Nope. It was, it was Second first. 2nd of July. 2nd of July, 1776. And because. 1776, but they made a fish on the 4th. Correct. They made a fish. I know. I'm official in terms of just the signature. Signature, yes. But uh, I know it's a lot of times always before. Just like with um, the Emancipation Proclamation. It wasn't. Uh, uh, it wasn't. But it, most it was always people before think the day. that, you know, it, it was the fourth. Yes. So yeah. That's just the official day. They official. just made when a day. When he signed. Yes. When he signed. Because you got signed me. Signed on the fourth. But they talked about it be like a it couple of days approved. before. Approved. And yes. And declared free on yes, the second. Yes. On the second. July, yes. But officially signed in the deed signed the declaration on the fourth so the fourth became the official day yes yes i don't uh, yeah so i I, but i knew 1776 now you know it's the second it's the second i I always knew i just in the fourth (laughs) whatever number six (laughs) harvard university okay harvard university was the first university ever established in the united states of america Harvard is the oldest Harvard college. Is the oldest college. Oh, wow. Okay, I didn't know that. Mm. And probably that's why it's the greatest. That's so not the greatest. Well, it, it's seen as the greatest. It's mm. part of the, um, what do they call it? Prestige. Them? Ivy League college. Uh, it's prestige. And but it's not the greatest. Great, like Princeton is, is knocking on the door. Princeton is, but is it's good. But it's seen as, you know, well, Princeton and, uh, and Harvard... They rank in not the same. Not yeah. the And Syracuse. And um, so, and then that's why you have your Barack Obamas mm-hmm. and your leaders. Uh, I mean, really great leaders go there. And still, if somebody's saying I go to Harvard, it's a college that you know the name is recognized, and it doesn't just accept anybody. So. Now, can I ask you something? Mm-hmm. Do you know most of these schools, colleges, where? In New Jersey. No, I'm not saying New Jersey. Yeah, but you, I say most Ivy League schools is in. You know, you know what part of the world they in? No, we only got one, we got one. That's the Princeton. Most of the Ivy League schools huh? is in what part of the world? I mean, in in the U.S. So it's not the world. Yeah, the U.S. See, the world is not U.S. Okay, the the, the U.S. Most I, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, I knew you probably didn't know that. It's most in the East Coast. I wanted to say that because I know Harvard, Princeton, Princeton, but I just I just didn't understand the question. <laughs> and Yale. Let's move on. Yale's in Connecticut. Number seven. Harvard <laughs> in Mass. <laughs> George Washington. Okay, Joe Washington. Was not the first president. The first. Person to be printed on one dollar bill. He was not the first person. Okay, I didn't know that. Who was the first person? I knew. Yeah, I didn't know that. Who was the first person? The Secretary of Treasury. What's the first person? Salmon, Salmon Chase. Salmon T. Chase. They probably like, All right, we gotta get you off of there. They got him off there. <laughs> and okay, maybe there. at that time the reason why because maybe they didn't know you know who to put these people on the dollar bill. Like, you know, on on the different things. So probably when the, they first... The different bills have different presidents. Yeah, but in the beginning, when they did the second day, they probably didn't know which, who, what, who to put, 
Yeah, who to put in? Because like, and in he would like he would like the, a, a a stop gap until they find out who they gonna put there. Yeah. Okay. Like in in South Africa, they don't put the president. No, they put animals. Animal. Um, Donna. Black. I don't know about other you know the rights and stuff. Our notes have changed a lot over the years. Okay. But it's like number eight. Mm-hmm. You know this one, but let's see if you remember. Okay. A Statue of Liberty. Yeah. The, okay. What about the Statue of Liberty? Was a gift from which country? Country. Was a gift from which country? Was it a gift from Europe? Oh, he oh. did. I thought he knew this because this was pretty easy. But I didn't know it was a gift. I thought it from another country. Yeah, it, it was shipped in. You don't oh. own it. It was shipped in. Yeah. I didn't, no, I, I, I don't remember. I know it's in New Jersey. People say New York, but yeah, New that's Jersey. another fact. That's <laughs> actually on, more on the side of Jersey. New Jersey, than yeah. It is of yeah, New York. you just want to, you did want to just claim everything. But which <laughs> country was it gifted? Who gifted? I don't know. I don't remember. The French. The French. Okay. Um, and it was because they were commemorating their alliance with the United States during the American Revolution. Okay. Okay, guys. We have the Eiffel Tower. Now I'm sure they regret it because America is coining in a lot of money. With yes, that's your living thing, you're right. And I don't think yeah. they even mentioned the French that it was gifted yep. and actually, <laughs> yep. you know, they make that it, they make it. They, they make it as if they own it. <laughs> but hey, a gift is a gift. So if yep. you give me something, I own it. And you know who get the money, right? America. No, New York. New York. Because they want to claim everything. <laughs> they get. They don't want to get the money. All right, let's go back to New York. Did you know? Like in New York was actually the first capital of the United States, New York City. I can believe it. I can believe it. So once the Constitution was ratified, in, this was 1901 plan of, um, 1901, I think, the, the 1901 plan for Washington, D.C., New York City was the first capital of the United States. I can believe it. New York was George one of the first. George Washington okay. took the oath of office to become the first president of the United States from the balcony of the old city hall in New York City. Mm, okay. And somehow, I think also Pennsylvania, I think, became second because mm-hmm. Pennsylvania was now called the, um, I think, the mother, the, the, something about America, the, the mother of America or something like that, the birth mm-hmm. of America. Mm-hmm. Because remember, even when the slaves were, yes, you know, yes, were running yeah. away from the South, they would go, to, go Pennsylvania. to Pennsylvania. Yeah, Pennsylvania and New York is one of the oldest states. You know, it, 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 they they one of the oh, Pennsylvania. New, that's a few Actually, states. Actually, the oldest one of the oldest states is 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 in the middle and somewhere. Is it in the middle? Let me tell you. Texas? Mm-mm. No, it's not Texas. Delaware. Delaware. It's in the East Coast. Delaware. Then, so, Pen, then Pennsylvania. Then Pennsylvania. Then New York. Then New Jersey. Oh, New Jersey? Yeah. Like, you, want, you want to, you want me to go through? By yeah, please. Okay, so order of states of admission. Okay. Delaware, mm-hmm. Pennsylvania, Pennsylvania, New Jersey. New Jersey. They were all done in one year, 1787. Okay. But in 1787. Yeah, different dates. But Delaware was December 7, mm. Pennsylvania December 12, New Jersey December 18. I guess because they were so close to each other. Delaware is close? Yeah. Pennsylvania. Delaware is where President uh, Biden is from, yes, right? Yes, yes. It's a very small state. It's a very, could you got to remember, you, didn't get, you can't get to Pennsylvania until you get to Delaware. Like, mm-hmm. So you got to go New Jersey, to Delaware, and then Pennsylvania. So they, I guess because they're so close to each other. So that's what they probably did. Delaware, Pennsylvania, New, York, New Jersey. And then number four, Georgia. Georgia. Oh, Georgia's number four? January 2nd, yep. What? 1788. So Georgia the fourth. Older state. Oh, okay. And the next one, number five, Connecticut. Connecticut. Mm-hmm. Wow, January okay. Eight. Number six, New York. Massachusetts. Massachusetts. Okay. Six. Eight. Number seven, New York. Maryland. <laughs> <laughs> Maryland. Okay, Maryland. April 20th, 28th, I mean, 1788. Okay. Number eight, New York. South Carolina. South Carolina. Okay. <laughs> wow. May 23rd, 1788. 
Number nine. New York. New Hampshire. New Hampshire. <laughs> yep. June 21st, 1788. Number 10. New York. Virginia. Virginia. <laughs> okay, New York. June 25th. I'm going to keep saying New York. <laughs> Number 11. New York. New York, the 11th. July okay. 26, 1788. I just can't get over New Jersey. It's the third oldest state. Yeah. Number 12, North Carolina. Oh, I'm not going to say the date. Uh, number 13, Rhode Island. Rhode Island. 14, Vermont. Okay. 15, Kentucky. 16, Tennessee. 17, Ohio. 18, Louisiana. 19, Indiana. Indiana. Just being Indiana. Okay. 20, Mississippi, 21, Illinois, 22, Alabama, 23, Maine, 24, Missouri, 25, Arkansas, 26, Michigan, 27, Florida, 28, Texas, 29, Ohio, Iowa, 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 Iowa 9, 30, Wisconsin, 31, California, 32, Minnesota, 33, Oregon, 34, Kansas, 35, West Virginia, okay. 36, Nevada, 37, Nebraska, 38, Colorado, 39, North Dakota, 48, South Dakota, 41, Montana, 42, Washington. Mm. Washington is actually the 42nd state. Yes. That is way down. Yeah, that's West Coast. Indiana, oh, uh, Washington State, they yeah, mean, oh, West Coast. all the up there. Okay. <laughs> no, no, there's not one. There's not one. Idaho. What is Idaho? What I never knew. What is, what is Idaho? I-D-A-H-O. Idaho. <laughs> Idaho. That's Idaho. Ida- Idaho, baby. <laughs> Idaho. Idaho. Idaho, okay. That's how I say it. I'm African. It's Idaho. I live in Idaho. I- Idaho, baby. 44 Wyoming. Okay, Wyoming. That's how, how you say it? Yeah, Wyoming. Wyoming. But if some some of these things don't even look attractive. I don't even. I don't think I want to even go to them. Mm. Um, forty-five, Utah. Okay, Utah. Forty-six, Oklahoma. Okay. Forty-seven, New Mexico. Okay. Forty-eight, Arizona. Forty-nine, Alaska, and fifty, Hawaii. Hold on. You know what state is missing? What? It's missing a state that's not that's not there. What? District of Columbia. There's 50 states here. District of Columbia. Because you know Washington, D.C. is District of Columbia. That's why I say D.C. Yeah. Washington uh, is a city. But this is what we have. Let's move on. So maybe they don't, they don't, they don't, they don't, I guess they don't consider District of Columbia a state. I don't know. I'm not a <laughs> Maybe, anyway. Maybe they don't consider a state because that's where, that's the, that's the whole, uh, that's the where the White House is at. That's the Let's capital. Move on. That's the capital of the U.S. Oh. So, okay. but there's uh, like there were there were contra- there was contradicting information when I was doing the research between Pennsylvania and New York. New York. So New- Pennsylvania could be the first New York, but there's like uh, he might have sworn in New York, but but really it was Pennsylvania. But people who know the information can help us in the comment section because there was contradicting. But they, they are, oh, they're Pennsylvania. Because I think it's Pennsylvania since New York was number 11. Mm-hmm. To be a state. Yeah. So. You know, but New York always was the popular state. Yeah. <laughs> and then number 10. Number 10, okay. There are six time zones. Six time zones. Yes. Yes, it mainland, is. Mainland, actually. Main, the mainland. Mainland. Do you know them? What do you mean mainland? Like in... It would East, be, West, you're talking about like that? Yeah. East? West, mm-hmm. North, South, Midwest. Time zones. Oh, I don't know. Oh, I, like Eastern time. Oh, Eastern, mm-hmm. Western. There's no Western. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Eastern, Pacific, uh, Mountain, uh, uh, Pacific, Mountain, Eastern. Uh, wow. Because Pacific is, is, is like California. Central. Central. Uh, that's all I know it for. I don't know the other two. See, I knew that you didn't know. 
I, I knew that. I know. I know four. That's why I came up with all these kind of amazing, <laughs> and interesting facts. But I know Eastern Pacific Mountain um, Central. Central. I know them so. And and Central, Central is like Chicago. We have Alaska. Al- See, that's why that's a new time zone. Okay, Alaska. And then we have Hawaii. Hawaii. That's why. See, that's why. It's called Hawaii Aleutian Pine. Okay, that's why I didn't know them because they. they I know because they stay snot. Yeah, so that's because they're on a different time zone than the the other four. Okay. So I. I, But I knew the one that was the 48 states. (laughs) I knew the other 48 states. It's 50. It's 50 now. But we don't. Because you got to remember. Now, you got. When I was in school learning this. We didn't have those other two. That's you new. Keep yourself updated. Yeah, it's I not, know. It's I not know. An excuse. <laughs> but that was new, so I didn't know. So of course, but I knew the I knew four. I didn't know the two newest ones. So yeah, thank you for sharing that with me because you yeah, a lot. yes, I learned a lot. About your country. Yes, yes. Fly high, America. <laughs> <laughs> so before we jump off, we want to say. I wasn't a hinge though. I didn't really like, I didn't really care for history like that. You don't though. have to care. You just have to know these are just, <laughs> I know. Gen- this is general knowledge, actually. I know, it is general knowledge. Just general knowledge. <laughs> if you, uh, you loved what you heard, you learned something, yes. do write a comment in the comment section and tell us what you think. Yes. And if there's any other thing that you think would be an interesting fact mm. about the America that we did not know, yes. well, some of us, some of the, um, the chillers don't know. Do write that in the yeah, comments. Yes, share section. it in the comments. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And then also on that note, we'd like to invite you to subscribe to this channel if you have not mm. done so. Help us to get to 2,000. Just, yes, 2,000. Just 2,000. That's yes, what we're asking 2000. for. 2,000. <laughs> 2,000. Yes, help us to get we to 2,000. We're almost at, on our anniversary uh, mm-hmm. Anniversary day. Yes, so we been are doing in our anniversary two years. month. Yeah, anniversary yes. month. Almost two years. Yeah, anniversary month. We pushing, we pushing. Yeah, and so we really would love to have more family members join in. Yes, all right. Yes, and if you don't want not like watching YouTube, you can listen to this podcast on all the podcast um, platforms. You know, when I say podcast platform, be there. Be there. Find mm-hmm. us there. Chilling with the chaplains. Also follow us on all social media. At Chilling with the chaplain. You can follow me personally at Ladies Season One. On Instagram, yeah, you can follow me at Guinness Spy by LJ on Instagram, Threads, you Lincoln, uh, as well as if you want to join the community, you're welcome to join the community, a vibrant community where we're able to learn, grow, and develop and that's become the best. Window. That's opportunity window, and let's yes, the, the 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 coupon code is still on live. Uh, episode 100, episode 100 is the coupon code to join the community for 90 days. We give Great. you a Yes, 90 uh, days hala. to test ah. us out. Yes, 90 days to test it out. And because if you like it, feel free to stay. If you don't, you can always cancel. Yep. So on that note, thank you for tuning in. See you next time. Deuces. Peace.